This week we made squiggles out of roller coasters. Yeah, because Samo rode her first roller coaster. Ah! You were very brave. Easy. And you rode a roller coaster. It's scary. It was a little faster than you expected. Yeah, I was like, ah! And there's me, right there, on the roller coaster. <laughs> he said it was the tamest one, so I started being like, Oh my gosh, this is the tamest one? Imagine what Silver Bullet is. Like... <laughs> Silver Bullet is Tyler's favorite. Mm -hmm. That's what it is. Are you proud of your sister? Yeah. You were so brave, even though I could hear you screaming the whole time. Mm -hmm. <laughs> So we took a bunch of pictures of a bunch of different roller coasters, traced them to make squiggles, and sent the squiggles to all of our friends to choose one to make art with. First up is me. I am making a bee and a flower out of this super cool squiggle made by three different roller coasters coming together. I love doing squiggles because I love how inspiring the shapes can be, but it kind of also lets you off the hook because you're already starting with a challenge. So I think it's liberating in a way because you're not thinking this has to be perfect. You're thinking this is for fun. <laughs> I like how the bee turned out. I think it turned out really pretty and I loved using watercolor for it. This is Aiden's dragon. Yeah, our friend Aiden, he's obsessed with rockets and engines and all things mechanical and also dragons. <laughs> A fish swimming out of a glowing purple glass cave that's kind of transparent and it's also on a purple amethyst cliff. <laughs> it's beautiful. I love the way you colored it. It's got so much light and life. Mm -hmm. This is Professor Pickle. He drew one of the funky ancient dolphins that you find in a lot of ancient architecture. They didn't know what a dolphin looked like and they sort of made it up. And they're all very strange looking. Here's my strange fellow with the bug on the tippy top of it, the curl of his hair. I love how weird this thing is. He's just such a weird, weird guy. This is Aiden's lab again, making a cathode ray tube, because of course he did. <laughs> And then this is an upside down dangling alien monkey creature wearing a green hat, and I adore him. Here's my person. <laughs> I saw that shape and saw a crazy smile and took it from there. Yeah. Built a character on the smile. I love how she turned out. She's really cute. The outfit and hair looks normal, but then the face is like, <gasps> she's a crazy person. <laughs> yeah. This is our friend Megorium again. She made this beautiful beta fish with her painterly style, and I love how it turned out. This is Raphael. He's funky little grumpy guy. Mm -hmm. I like how she did the scales. I also like how she did the fin part. Her streaky, swooshy. It's so detailed. This time around, Big LED sent us the Golden Pirate Hunter from Ghana. Yee! And then we also have Elisamba this time from Cape Town, South Africa. 
I love how we have multiple Ellie's from Africa. <laughs> Hello from California. Ellie Samba is a designer. His motto is aspire to inspire. And we adore that. So he drew this amusement park inspired guy who's got the delicious snack. He forgot his drawing tablet at work over the weekend. So he ended up having to draw it in Adobe Illustrator. And I think he did a fantastic job. I love how he matched the line weights. Ooh. 